Parade of Homes, as we just mentioned, is happening this Sunday. It is a way to see some beautifully new homes at various stages of construction and to get some really great ideas for your own home. Nina Bender is the marketing director at Bender and is here to talk about choosing kitchen cabinets. And we talked earlier how important it is to really renovate the kitchen and bathrooms, but especially kitchens. Why is that? So kitchens are the center of your home. That's where the activity happens and that's All where the people spend is. a lot of time. Yes. Yeah. It's also what people are looking for if they're looking to instead of uh, build or buy new construction to buy a home that's been previously lived in and maybe they're looking to not do any work so you want to put a great kitchen in before you sell or right when you move in or they're looking at a kitchen and saying hmm, what can I do with this and one of the things you say is cabinets yeah so you want to think about the cabinets that you put in your home and I like to think of it as a good better best option three things to look at are the or the three good better best options okay. are a partial overlay which is this style where you have the cabinet door partially overlaying the cabinet box and this is a a good budget savvy option so you basically keeping your kitchen cabinet but just changing the floor? Oh no, if you're, if you're renovating the kitchen and putting new cabinets okay, in. Okay, this or, is a totally new cabinet. Right, or if okay. you're looking to identify what the home has and you want to like think about that intelligently and say is this right for me, something to look at is the type of door. Okay. So this is a partial overlay where you see this section of the box and the drawer is partially covering it. And Very that's a, nice. That's a good budget savvy option. Okay. And our next the So that's good. Stage. The better stage <laughs> okay. is right over here. This is what's called a full overlay. And it's got slow closed doors, okay. so if you would have hardware on here, but if you close it, it sort of it closes on its own. Slowly up, it closes on its own. Same thing with the drawer. Let's see if we can okay. open it. Can you get it? Let me get it. There we go. Got so it. now try and there close it. Okay. A little harder. Okay. There you go. So it stops. It doesn't slam. Okay. And that's full overlay. You're covering the whole box. That's called full overlay. Yeah. We have partial overlay, full, full overlay. Full overlay. And that's and sort of middle of the road. Okay. This is, I love this. This is my dream home. I don't have this yet, but someday I will. This is inset. So if you put your hand down, you've got the cabinets fitting, the cabinet doors fitting flush into the box. And that's a really nice style. And how do you determine what color of, of cabinets you need to put in the kitchen? If you, if, I, I've always heard if you're a smaller kitchen, you should go with lighter color. I like a smaller kitchen, and, or I, I like a lighter color in a smaller kitchen because it brightens up the space, but it's really a personal style. One thing that I learned that I thought was so interesting about inset doors, because you know everybody's dream is to live on the waterfront. My dream is to live on the waterfront with inset cabinets. <laughs> I was talking to one of the designers. They said, don't do that because inset, you're, you have a real wood box, but if you're on the waterfront, chances are high humidity and they'll expand, so they might get stuck. So for a waterfront home, that dream waterfront home, do a full overlay. Full, okay, full overlay. All right, for more information on any of the products we've seen, where do they need to go, Nina? They need to go to BenderShowrooms.com or visit us in any of our locations. We've got our Norwalk store opening this week. Very excited about that. All right, and really quickly, again, the Parade of Homes is this Sunday. Yes, October 18th, this Sunday, homeowners and prospective home buyers can visit homes throughout southern New England. Great. Southern Connecticut. Southern not Connecticut. All right, thank you, Nina. <laughs> All right, Ryan, what you have? Hey, thank you so much. Uh, 